children of all ages and all degrees of mental acuity. It's Uncle Dan back with another episode of Uncle Dan's Vintage Vinyl, the YouTube channel that answers the question, what is the most egregious way in which I can waste my time? Today I'm here with a, with a, just here to give you a little quickie, you know, uh, and I'm here to tell you, I want you to take a chance on love. Well, man, take a chance on vinyl. That's what I'm here really to talk to you about, is taking a chance on vinyl. Uh, I went down to Cheapo Records in St. Paul yesterday, and uh, in uh, uh, scouring the very cheap records, I came across this obvious gem. Uh, Don Jacoby, have cons, will travel. Uh, and uh, I, you know, I mean, I mean, look at him, look at him, look at him. Uh, you know, furry chaps and uh, and uh, cowboy hat and uh, you know, and, and a con, actually a con trumpet and a con cornet. Uh, the man played both. Uh, and it's uh, you know, one of the great things about it is you know, it's cons con installation and con was a manufacturer, well, still is, I think, maybe manufacturer of uh, of uh. Uh, at least used to be a manufacturer of musical instruments, including the, you know, the trumpet and, and cornet that Mr. Mr. John Jacoby are, are, uh, uh, is pictured with. And then one of the great things too, oh, won't you look at that? It, it is, it done been autographed, maybe by Mr. Jacoby himself. Now, usually I get things that are autographed by somebody else, but. Uh, 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 you know, and this may cheapen it having Mr. Don Jacoby's uh, autograph on it rather than, you know, Henry's or Moe's or somebody like that. But anyway, this one, uh, this one, uh, I, I decided to take a chance on because it was $3.20 and Mr. Jacoby is looking so styling, you know, and, and I have a thing too for trumpet jazz and stuff like that. And I thought, oh, okay, uh, and when reading the back of it, I saw that he'd been a, like a big band trumpeter and then got hired by Khan to go around and demonstrate. So he was, uh, and, and teach. So he's basically a trumpet teacher uh, and uh, going around and being a clinician of trumpet uh, after the early 50s, I, uh, I believe. But yeah, he played with Les Brown, Benny Goodman, uh, and, you know, a bunch of people like that. Fritz Chrysler, you know, uh, you know learned, played with a bunch, bunch of folks. Uh, and he's, uh, uh, you know, I thought, well, you know, three dollars and twenty cents plus tax, you know, it's three fifty, something thereabouts, uh, you know, here in here in the great state of Minnesota. Uh, you know, why not? What the heck? You know, let's give it a whirl. And I brought it home, and I threw it on the old you know, Gerard or Gerard, as you know, a lot of Americans say, it, but uh, Gerard Type A uh, turntable. And the first side. Starts off with Napoli, and you'll look it up, you'll know it. In fact, you can get the whole album on uh, uh, on uh, YouTube. Uh, yay, copyright. Uh, but uh, uh, this, and, and by the way, the album is from about, I think it's 59. So, uh, but uh, I started listening to it, I'm like, you know what? This is actually freaking great. The guy, some of the stuff may be a little cheesy, uh, but in terms of his uh, trumpet, trumpet and uh, cornet work, man, man, uh, man had the chops, you know. So I'm, I've uh, listened to the one side and uh, listened to the second side, the second side, the B side, flip side on this. You know, I, that's pretty great. You know, it's a, a great tone, great, uh, great plan, and uh, I highly recommend it. So anyway, what I'm really here to tell you, though, is not so much recommend, you know, Don Jacoby. Maybe you'd like Don, maybe you wouldn't like Don, but what I am recommending is that, you, you know, you take a chance on vinyl, children. You take a chance on love. You know, who knows? You might find something that, you, you know, you ain't expecting. I've picked up a bunch of things just for the heck of it, uh, you know, and just, just picked them up because the, the uh, covers were great. One of my favorite albums of all time, uh, although I first had it on CD, uh, is... Uh, Weird Tales by Golden Smog, and I've listened to that man. I've listened to that until uh, until the pits are almost worn off the CD, uh, and I bought that just on a whim because the cover looked cool. And you know, go out find something with a cool cover or something wacky. Who knows? You may like it. You know, and you know, three fifty. You know that. You know that that'll get you 
part way toward a cup of coffee these days, right? So there you go. Uncle Dan, the vinyl man, with uh, my tip of the day. Take a chance, children on love, on vinyl. Uh, take a chance on love and vinyl. And remember, hit like and subscribe. And we look forward to seeing you next time. Okay, Jones. Uncle Dan saying au revoir. And in addition, I'll be